सब्सक्राइब कीजिए नेहरा क्लासेस यूट्यूब चैनल को और बेल आइकन को दबाइए हमारे लेटेस्ट वीडियोस के नोटिफिकेशंस पाने के लिए हाय गाइस हाउ आर यू वंस अगेन वेलकम बैक टू अवर नेहरा क्लासेस यूट्यूब चैनल एंड दिस इज योर फ्रेंड विकास नेहरा फ्रेंड्स इन टुडे सेशन वी शैल डिस्कस द फीचर ऑफ कॉकपिट इन रेड हेट एंटरप्राइज लाइन एक्स एट और इन सेंटो एस एट फ्रेंड्स बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग फर्दर लेट मी गिव द ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट दिस फीचर एक्चुअली कॉकपिट इज अ वेब बेस्ड टूल विच कम्स अलोंग विद आर एच ई एल और सेंटो एस एट विच कैन बी यूज फॉर सर्वर एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन एंड मोनिटरिंग पर्पज इट इज अ जी यू आई वेब बेस्ड टूल इन विच वी कैन लॉग इन विद अवर क्रेडेंशियल्स स्पेशली विद रूट क्रेडेंशियल्स एंड आफ्टर दैट वी कैन मैनेज सेवरल फीचर्स एंड सेटिंग्स इन अवर मशीन एनी वेयर फ्रॉम द वर्ल्ड वी कैन एक्सेस अवर सर्वर फ्रॉम एनी वेयर इफ द पब्लिक आई पी इज अलोटेड टू इट सो लेट मी शो यू हाउ कैन वी कन्फिगर इट एज आई हैव टोल्ड यू दैट इट कम्स बाई डिफॉल्ट इन अवर मशीन सो इन आर एच एल्स एट और इन सेंटो एस एट देर इज नो नीड टू इंस्टॉल द पैकेज बट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू अवेल दिस सर्विस ऑन आर एच एल सेवन और ऑन सेंटो एस सेवन इन दैट केस यू फर्स्ट नीड टू डाउनलोड एंड इंस्टॉल द पैकेज ऑफ कॉकपिट आई एम यूजिंग आर एच ई एल एट सॉरी सेंटो एस एट हेयर सो इन दिस इट इज बाई डिफॉल्ट प्री इंस्टॉल्ड आफ्टर दैट वट यू नीड टू डू यू नीड टू स्टार्ट द कॉकपिट सर्विस इफ इट इज नॉट रनिंग इन दी सर्वर सो फॉर दैट यू नीड टू रन सिस्टम सी टी एल रिस्टार्ट कॉकपिट डॉट सॉकेट लेट मी वेरीफाई द स्टेटस ऑफ दिस बाई सिस्टम सी टी एल स्टेटस कमांड हेयर यू कैन सी दैट दिस सर्विस इज रनिंग after that you need to add it in the firewall so that you can access it from outside of the server for that you need to run firewall hyphen cmd hyphen hyphen permanent hyphen hyphen add hyphen service is equal to cockpit press enter i i have already added it that is why it is showing as already enabled now we are ready to use it so for that you need to open a web browser you can use any web browser if you are on the same network you can use the ip of your machine the ip of my machine is 192.168.10.108 colon 9090 you have to write this in the address bar and press enter here after that it will ask for the user credentials you can mention here root and provide the root password and press enter after that you can log in into the web console of your machine and you can see a lot of things here you can use the mon use it for the monitoring and for the administration purpose as well there are different tabs in this console which can be used for the different purposes so first tab is system tab which provides the information of the system here you can see the cpu utilization your memory and swap utilization input output details network traffic and you can see the hardware details assist tag machine id domain system time and you can even reboot the machine from here the second tab shows the logs here you can see different logs and you can filter the logs on the basis of date and time and on the basis of the severity what type of log you want to see you can select it 
from this drop down menu here and you can see third tab is about storage here you can see the storage details if red is configured you can see the red details volume groups video details scsi targets here you can see the utilization of your file systems reading writing speed storage logs as well and drive details so all these details you can see from this storage tab if you click on the network tab so from this tab you can see the network details network traffic which is coming and outgoing from your server network name ip address and network logs all these details you can watch from this tab next tab is accounts tab here you can manage the user accounts i am uh, i have only two accounts one is root account and another one is normal account so from this tab you can even create the new account in the server as well if you are not familiar with terminal or commands so this tool is very beneficial for those people who do not know how to create the users from the uh, from the cli next tab is about the services what services are running in the system all those details of the services which are which are running or suspended or active inactive each and every service will be displayed here so you can manage the services as well you there are several other tabs as well targets sockets timers paths next tab is applications tab what applications are installed and running you can see all, all those details from this tab next tab is about diagnostic reports so you can create the report with the help of this tab here kernel dump i have already enabled it so you can enable and disable it uh, disable it from here and you can test the configuration as well of your kernel dump sc linux status whether it is enforcing or permissive you can turn it off as uh, as well from here so sc linux status and details can be checked and changed from this tab next tab is software updates so with the help of this tab you can install the updates in your machine you can manage the updates and the last one is very powerful tab that is the terminal with the help of this you can run any command which you want to run and you can do whatever you want with the help of cli so if you are away from your server suppose if you are on the remote location and public ip is allotted to your server in that case you can access and manage your server with the help of this terminal here and this so in this way it is very useful tool for those people who use linux and who are linux administrators and generally they live away from the server so th those people can access and manage and monitor his or her server from any remote location as well there are several other options as well so if you cl click on this root drop down here you can dis uh, display the language if you want to know the cockpit details cockpit version and other details you can click on this tab if you want to change the settings for the account you can do it from this and there is a there is an option of authentication and logout as well here so friends this was the very good tool which was introduced in rhcl 8 for linux administrators so i hope i have provided you all the necessary information regarding this cockpit web tool if you like the video if you found it useful then do share it with your friends and if you are new on our channel then do not forget to subscribe it and turn on the bell notification i will see you guys with in any other interesting linux video till then bye bye jai hind vande mataram